My first flight was two weeks, and a lot had to get done. I distinctly remember the point when I stopped and thought, I did it, I'm here. My goal was to be an astronaut, and now I'm in space. I remember seeing the beauty of Earth, but I don't remember any more profound thoughts about it at that point. I think it was when I got into my long duration flight and spent a little more time that I really just started to take it in a little bit more. The entire experience is actually very surreal. First, you're launched on a rocket. You're pulling G's, as you're, you're going out of the atmosphere, you're looking at the Earth for the first time, you're floating, you're, everything is different, and it just is all just such a different experience that it almost doesn't seem real. In fact, when I did my space shuttle flight for two weeks in 2008, when I got back, you could have convinced me I never went probably, if there weren't pictures. This experience is so unusual and so different than anything you've ever done in your life that it's hard to grasp at all. And I was very excited then when I got assigned to a long duration because I thought it's going to burn in my memory and all that, and it was the same thing. I came back and my memories were there, but it, it almost didn't seem real. Looking at the Earth for the first time, you just notice the vibrancy of it. It's so bright, pictures don't do it justice. It's equivalent to me of backpacking out the mountains where you're trekking along and then you come to a clearing and you're overlooking some valley and the sun is setting and it is, you know, you're like, how could this get any prettier? And you take a picture and then you go back and look at the pictures later and you never have that feeling again. It, it never brings about the feeling that it did. And same with watching a beautiful sunset or a sunrise. I have not seen a picture that gives me the same feeling that I felt when I looked with my own eyes. It started to make me understand that everything is connected. What is happening in the ocean over here can affect what is happening on land over here. It's just all one being and it's all interconnected. And so I think we tend to live in our bubble of our world that's here and it's hard to think about other people on the other side of the world and be empathetic toward them really because you don't know them and you don't know their situations and I found seeing the earth really changing that perspective for me and then listening to a news story in the morning and flying over that particular part of the world in the afternoon it really affected me and then just realizing I mean, that's, it's home. Often we think home, and you know, right now home is Houston, Texas, and childhood home is Minnesota, but home is Earth.